persist data in our backend, we're going to need a database. Now, there are a lot of databases out there, and it can be tricky to know which one to go for. Uh, so we created a video it's called How to Choose a Database for Your App that you can check out, link down below. For our app, we decided to go with PostgreSQL. So PostgreSQL is the world's most popular relational database. It's been active development for over 30 years. It's been trusted by many companies. So it's a solid choice for our use case. Now, we're going to need um, a hosted PostgreSQL database. So there are many ways that you can set one up. Uh, you can use Prisma's data platform. We have a video on that, link down below as well. Uh, so like it uses Heroku under the hood and it gives you uh, a connection string so that you can actually connect to this database very easily. Alternatively, during development, you can use a local PostgreSQL database. Now we have a video that shows how to set up uh, a local PostgreSQL instance on macOS. And we also have in our data guide, um, an article that goes over how to set up with Windows and Linux. So make sure that you check one of these resources out. And yeah, uh, you're going to need a database.